Hi, welcome to Unboxing with Rob. And today, we have some Green Lanterns in the house. So first off, we have, okay, like I always call him Gnort. I don't know if that's how you actually pronounce his name, but I always say Gnort. Maybe some people just say Nort. But we have this guy, and then we have good old Kilowog. So, these are some older figures. Uh, let's check out uh, Gnort first. So, Justice League International, it says. Here's some of the pictures of some of the members of Justice League International. Because he was a member of that uh, group for a little while. And then on the back, we have, we have a cool looking Batman. Kind of metallic uh, uh, cape, which is kind of weird. Uh, we have Ice, also in a metallic looking uh, costume. And then we have a Black Canary. She looks pretty cool, like in her uh, older uh, costume. And then we have Gnort. So let's open it up. Just ripped this thing, which is unfortunate because it looks like it was something. Oh, well. So it's a little promo here uh, coming soon. We have Green Lantern, Wonder Woman, Flash, uh, looks like Geoforce, uh, Calabac, um, Superman. Uh, we have Big Barda and Metron. And then down here we have another uh, Wonder Woman, Batman, Superman, and Flash. So, yeah, this one looks like it's a Batman vs. Superman um, comic style. Uh, this one, like a, a Jack Kirby looking style. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. So, well, unfortunately, we ripped it, but it's really nothing we need to save, so that's fine. All right, now let's take him out of here. again he's all scrapped in because apparently that's what they like to do is strap figures in for us so we have a heck of a time getting them out of course this being uh, an older figure they use the actual wires to strap them in So here we got a, a nice base. This is Justice League on there, International. It's a clear base, I like that. It looks good. That'll look really good for the figures. I don't particularly think we need a stand for this figure. I think he has a pretty good uh, base on the bottom here where he's not gonna be going anywhere. So let's get his tail in there. I don't know how far that tail's supposed to go in. I would assume it would go all the way, but anyway, it's not a really big deal. Um, his hands, his arms do bend at the elbow. His legs do not, so he's more of a statue, statue figure. His mouth does open and close, so that's pretty neat. Yeah, so for Gnort, that's actually pretty cool. He's got his uh, ring right there around his hand. I like how his feet are sculpted. His head's pretty cool. So yeah, it's a nice little uh, addition for Green Lantern uh, core. So there he is, Gnort. Put him to the side. All right. Now we have the big boy, Kilowog. Oh, let's check out his packaging. So up here we got a bunch of characters in the series. Series 1, Green Lantern. On the back, we have uh, Fallon X, we have Hal Jordan, Black Hand, uh, looks like we have a couple of Guardians, and then Killwog himself. So, yeah. Oh, he comes with a Green Lantern base. Ooh, this is pretty nice. I like the base here. Um, I don't particularly think we're going to need a base for Kilowog because he's a pretty bulky character. 
I think he'll stand uh, on his own pretty well. And once again, we got a bunch of wires here. But these aren't particularly tied very tight, so it's easy to get out. Now we had some yellowing of the package here, but I don't believe that affected the figure any. It looks like he's still pretty uh, pristine in coloring. Maybe a little bit of the white might have changed color. I can't really tell. But yeah, he looks pretty cool. It looks like he's going to have zero trouble standing. Uh, let's see, his mouth doesn't open. His arms do bend. His hands twist. Um, he has one punching fist, one kind of clinch fist, so he could hold something in his hand. He has his knees bend. His waist bends, or you know, bends in the middle. He's really good looking, uh, Kilowog. And he comes with a Green Lantern, so that's pretty neat. And that would just go right there in his hand, I assume. Yeah, so that just goes right in there. And there you have it, Kilowog. And good work. And once again, don't just uh, like toys, love toys.